Hi guys, this is Samya Midan and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is all about my current skincare favorites. Now, if you have been reading my blog, www.samyamidan.com, you would know that a few weeks back was our wedding anniversary and my husband gifted me a couple of skincare products because I love skincare more than makeup. That's because I don't have makeup talents. Like, shh. <laughs> so, um, I have been using it for a couple of weeks and I do have my favorites and my wording. Let's jump in. The first one is the Body Shop Drops of Youth. It's a moisturizer. Uh, how do you respond when your husband gives you a youth cream? Mm, I get it. Hint, hint, I get his hints. Now, it's a very... Ah, fresh smelling, creamy, velvety texture moisturizer. It's quite thick, but it doesn't make your skin oily. It did not break me out. I use it every single night. There's so many claims about this a youth cream and everything, which I will be leaving down in the description box. Now, this has the stem cell extracts of three resilient plants, which means it's gonna give you fresh skin, more youthful looking skin. It's gonna help with fine lines and everything. I have been using it for almost four weeks, every single night. And I can see that the dry patches on my cheeks, it was very prominent, and the little dry patch on my chin area, which was again really like out there for everyone to see, it's gone. So that's great. Uh, my skin looks well rested as well and as I mentioned it did not break me out It's it's really nice. I love the way it smells I love the whole experience of taking this very luxurious cream and putting it on my face and I don't know Yeah <laughs> So yeah, that's my current favorite The next one is uh, again from body shop. It's the vitamin C micro dermabrasion exfoliant cream I have never got you know a spa exfoliation or a microdermabrasion or those kind of things ever in my life so i will not be able to say that this is as good as that however i really like it now this is i'll tell you um, they say it's smooth it onto the wet skin massage in circular motions and it improves the skin tone um, i use my face wash then i use this I mildly, very mildly and very slowly, you know, with circular motions, massage it onto my face, especially concentrating on my T-zone, especially the nose area and rinse it off within like 40 seconds and I do feel like it exfoliates my skin and has vitamin C, it brightens my skin. Uh, however, if you have extremely sensitive skin and if you have acnegenic skin, then definitely stay away from it. But if you have my kind of combination skin, you have normal skin, this is a good thing to try. However, I try it only once in a week. Though they say you can use it twice a week, I feel that, that would be a little too much for my skin. So this is something I have been loving and if I am thinking of doing any overnight masking and stuff like that, using any face mask, I exfoliate my face using this and then use the mask and I definitely find that uh, the mask penetrates better into my skin. That's something I really like. It has um, Amazonian camo, camo, and community fair trade shea butter. Shea butter is very good for our skin. Everybody knows. I don't want to go on and on about it. So if you are going to the body shop, I would definitely suggest you to pick this up and try it. <laughs> Moving on. One more body shop product. Trust me, guys, I'm not sponsored. Do I wish? <laughs> This is the almond hand and nail butter. Now, if they say butter, they mean butter. I'll show you. There you go. Okay, I don't know if you can see. It's quite thick. It's very, very thick a consistency. It's more like a conditioner kind of a consistency. If you know, if I have already mentioned, I don't know, but I have farmer's hands. Yeah, I have always been having this kind of hands, like always. But then after marriage and everything, you know, there's so much of laundry, there's so much of cleaning and scrubbing and dishwashing. I just, I just definitely dislike the way my hands look. Got wrinkles and fine lines and dry skin. I have got dry skin here even during the summers. I mean, that is the heights of it, right? So 
with this farmer's hand, I need something really thick and moisturizing. And I generally like the way this moisturizes and softens my hands. So I'll not say it's healthy with the fine lines or anything like that. But this is something that every skin type person can try. I remember my mom using this once as well. So yeah, whatever your age is, whatever you do in life, this is a hand cream I can recommend universally to anyone and everyone. It has sweet almond oil and it has community fair trade Brazil nut oil. You know, I like my oils. <laughs> now the last, last, last but not the least. This is not from Body Shop. Yeah. This is Nivea Q10 Plus Anti-Wrinkle Eye Care Eye Cream. It has coenzyme Q10. Uh, it minimizes dark under eye circles. Wrinkles around the eyes are visibly reduced. I do not have wrinkles. However, I have crazy number of fine lines. And I started realizing that cause I started doing YouTube videos. You know the th things you realize about yourself when you are in front of the camera and then you see yourself in the laptop and people start commenting like oh you have under eye bags thank you oh you have crazy fine lines thank you <laughs> so i started getting way too conscious about my under eye area and i just picked it up like three weeks back and i have been religiously using this every single night now one thing i can tell you is i am a mom which means i do not get the uninterrupted eight hours of sleep and I also have bad habits like being on Pinterest and Instagram late at night, like 2 a.m. Guilty. <laughs> and uh, again, I do not drink those eight glasses of water every day, 30 minutes of exercise, wearing sunglasses. I don't do those kind of things, which is really bad. So I'm not expecting one cream to change the way my under eye area looks. However, I can say that it definitely has brightened my under eye area at least a 5 to 10 percent which is huge my fine line haven't disappeared but it's not as deep as it used to be and after applying this I wait for like 10 minutes then I put on my makeup and concealer and everything and I feel um, I don't have any dry patches on that under eye area and my concealer goes on way much more smooth that's why I really like this and if you have been following me on Instagram that's how I'm with it. <laughs> Shameless me, what am I doing? <laughs> then you know that I have raved about this cream in a couple of posts. No, I mean, not a couple of posts, like a couple of weeks back. So that's it. These are my current skincare favorites and I genuinely like these products. If you have my kind of skin type, you can definitely try it. If you have tried any of these products and if you have any other product recommendations, do mention it in the comment section down below. For further details about the products, you can expand the description box. And I hope you guys really enjoyed. Please subscribe, please like, please share. Bye.